good day uh, today i'm going to talk about uh, plant based medicine for specific illnesses so uh, let's see we'll take each illness and see what are the plants that are suitable plant number so first illness phlegm related illnesses like we scatter uh, and uh, difficulties in breathing and all that the good uh, medicine plants would be plant based plant based uh, medicine can be can be uh, coriander uh, dried ginger uh, tipili valmi and uh, katwal batu right then uh, let's say if you are having uh, high temperature you can use uh, uh, tortillamol and patpadagam then if you are having uh, a gastric related illness then you can use bilimol irivaria and kaladurol then if you are having uh, high blood pressure or high cholesterol high blood cholesterol Oh, you can make use of uh, you know detoxification, where you flush your body of many toxins, and also you'll uh, when you're flushing you'll find some of uh, it has ability to remove some of the the fat as well. And then uh, uh, if you have diabetes, diabetes, uh, you can make use of. Uh, kotal hima to and uh, uh, ranoramal and also uh, madam potu so then uh, if to imi- to Im- enhance your immunity we can make use of uh, uh, vinaigrette and uh, dr- dried ginger and uh, if you have uh, kidney related problems uh, to if you have a blocked kidney that is uh, you know where you need you can see that your your blood purification is not at the right level then you can use kiribadwala asana and nerenchi and to to improve the function of the kidney you can make use of iramusu niramulia iramusu and niramulia so for each kind of illness you can have a uh, 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 separate uh, medicine medicinal plants that are very effective so let's say you know somebody is having uh, somebody has already flushed the body of uh, toxins for about 2 uh, weeks and now you like to actually treat your real illness so if somebody is having phlegm related illness because you have already flush your body now you can uh, start treating uh, keep on flushing while uh, treating the illness as well for that uh, we generally use uh, decoction with uh, 5 grams each uh, having uh, 12 items so all together 60 grams and uh, to keep the body flushed uh, we use aralo senecola and iramulia so and then uh, to enhance the immunity we use vinaigrette and uh, to uh, destroy any uh, any toxicity inside the body we use rathandun alpattu dumalagandu and uh, then uh, we also can use kombapattu and bellimol so this will give nine items and then uh, we can actually concentrate on the next three so our base is that our base is arulu bulu rasakinda uh, arulu bulu uh, senekola sorry i'll go in the other one arulu uh, arulu senekola arulu senekola uh, dirumulia so three items and then uh, we can make use of uh, alapattu dumalagandu rattadon so six items 
and then uh, we can also make use of uh, uh, vinegar to comb and uh, uh, and bulu. So we have nine items and bulu. Altogether nine items. And then what you do is we can have three items and these three items can be adjusted to suit our, il our illness. So if you have inflammatory inflammatory-related illness, what you do is we make use of uh, valmi, tipili and katarbatu. If you have gastric related illness, for these three items we use irivaria, bilimul uh, and uh, uh, kalandul water. And if you have, uh, if you want to really flush your body, because you are having uh, high blood pressure and high cholesterol, high blood cholesterol level, what you can do is you have to keep on flushing. So which we, what we do is we use katakotasana and uh, bilimul, and uh, if you want, you can use irambasu. So all this will keep on flushing and uh, help you to uh, flush uh, the body of uh, ex uh, excessive uh, fat as well. And uh, if you are having uh, diabetes, uh, you, for these three items, we use uh, Kotalim 2 and uh, uh, Rana Ramal and uh, we can uh, make use of, if, if available, Madam Pottu. Otherwise, we make use of Valmi. And uh, then, uh, if you are having migraine, for these three items, we use uh, uh, Belimul, Valmi, and Tipili. And uh, so, so, I have covered the phlegm, diabetes, diabetes and uh, then uh, gastritis, uh, high blood pressure. So these are the common illnesses. And uh, if you're having um, a kind of uh, uh, flu type situation, you are, you are running high temperature also, then you can make use of Valmi, Tipiri and Totilmul. So, so, the way that you use the medicine is more or less the same and uh, where you boil 8 cups to 1 and use half of the cup in the night with sign the ludu and uh, the next day you, use half, you drink half a cup early in the morning with, sign, with uh, one, uh, one te teaspoon of bee sunny, you have to get high quality bee sunny. So what he generally says, you know, try this for about four days per week and you can try this uh, uh, medicine over four weeks. So what actually happens is uh, at the end of uh, this period, you will find uh, your body looks very lean, uh, very light and radiant. And uh, your skin complexion also improve because uh, your body is now having much less toxins, uh, you have got rid of most of the toxins that have been, that have accumulated. So what we recommend is, uh, try this, uh, once you try one and a half months of uh, treatment, then uh, with uh, first starting with a huge flush, then we go two weeks with uh, six medicine, six plant uh, items uh, decoction, then we try one month with uh, a total of 16 decoctions having 12 plants. And then if you want, uh, if you feel that you like to repeat, uh, you can repeat whatever you like. Uh, but if you had to repeat the first one, big flush, you use it for one day. If you are using uh, six item one, you can use it for two weeks. And uh, if you are using the last one, you can use it even for one month, no side effects, because you are flushing your body of all the toxins and all the time you feel uh, very, uh, very, uh, you know, satisfied because your body weight looks less and your tummy will be flatter and uh, it, uh, you, do, you will not develop any toxic gases in your, in your stomach, so you feel very comfortable. 
then uh, uh, how do you actually help this with your dietary habits? So if you want to improve your immunity in the body, then uh, you must make sure you have enough vitamin D in your body. And how you get vitamin D is you have to actually, if you are in a, in a tropical country and your, your skin is a little darker, a fair skin, not white skin, then uh, you need at least minimum 20, uh, 20 minutes of exposure to uh, develop sufficient vitamin D. So we rec generally recommend walking under the sun for about half an hour. And uh, after doing that, you, if, you have a, if you like to cycle, you can cycle for a little time, 10-15 uh, minutes under the sun. And, uh, and then uh, to, uh, to ensure that your body system immunity restores fast, we generally recommend you to uh, eat uh, at least one egg per day or if possible, one egg in the morning and one egg, in the, one egg for lunch. And, uh, on, but uh, if you are already too fat and you like to reduce your body weight, what we recommend is uh, have a plain tea without any sugar in the morning and walk up for about four kilometers. And then if you have a cycle, uh, use the cycle for about rather 20 to 30 minutes. So one hour workout and uh, because your stomach is empty, all the energy, all the energy for for your work uh, morning exercise program will come from the fat that is already accumulated in the body, and you'll find the body fat can be uh, removed pretty fast. Uh, then what you do is, uh, uh, you know, for morning uh, you have to have a very light. Uh, you know, you can have a reasonable uh, breakfast. And uh, what we generally recommend is one egg. Uh, if you want to have a little bit of rice, you can do that. But uh, you have to have plenty of uh, vegetables and you can have a piece of fish. And for lunch also, you can have a little bit of rice, uh, egg, and uh, a lot of uh, greens, uh, boiled vegetables. And... Uh, and you can even have a fruit before you start your lunch and uh, or banana before you start your lunch and also we recommend you to have about two glasses of water half an hour before you like to have the lunch and then uh, in the night uh, you can go for a very light meal like a soup or boiled vegetables and if you really want you can have very little quantity of uh, red and white right mix and we generally again uh, recommend you go for traditional varieties of rice available in Sri Lanka. So this way you can actually, uh, when you go on a diet like this, very fast you can lose excess fat in your body because you, have, you are linking it with the exercise program and you are going on a protein rich diet that will help you to reduce uh, blood cholesterol level, the, uh, the blood sugar level and because you are, you are flushing your body of toxins, uh, your body, full body immunity will be restored very fast and with the very mild uh, medicines that you know in our 12, uh, 12 part uh, decoction we have three parts for the illness and with a very low dose of uh, uh, plant extracts, you can cure most of your illnesses. But uh, you have to identify the type of illness and select the correct plant. So this is what we call modern plant-based medicine and, this, and we have practiced it. And I myself practice it whenever I have illness. And uh, I generally don't go to see doctors and I don't use, uh, generally I don't use any antibiotics. And the maximum I use is uh, just one or two Panadol. But if you have a severe virus attack, uh, then I might use uh, Panadine for one or two days. Otherwise, you know, most of the time we rely a lot on when you have better and other plant-based medicine. Thank you.